Hello you lovely people, welcome back to accountinglecture.com. In this particular video, I'm going to show you balancing of accounts. Like how you're going to do balance CD and BD. CD means carried down, BD means brought down. Very often it is known as CF, carried forward, or BF, brought forward, not the boyfriend all right okay bank account now generally bank account is a debit account um you we assume we have money into the bank the business has money into the bank uh, but it can be overdrawn as well let's see what happens in this particular one. how do you do balancing balance cd with the rule is uh, you got to get the total of both side basically the column first and you need to check which side is bigger the added up of these three and added up of these two which side is bigger uh, if you add these three you get a figure of 410 and these two 400 so 410 is the bigger uh, figure which you need to write as a total both side then obviously these two does not make 410 410 minus these two is remaining is 10 pound that is your balancing figure we call it balance cd balance carried down and the date is always last date of that particular month which is 30th of april the same balance cd becomes balance bd on the other side of the account after the total which is 10 pound we call it balance bd brought down and that's the first of the next month first of may after april may comes that's how you do your balance cd bd we'll be doing quite a few maybe two to three just to show you different types of balance cd bd can happen in a t account purchase account is a debit account uh we're going to do balance cd bd for this following the same method total for both sides clearly debit side is bigger which is two to four hundred and fifty nothing on the credit side 450 and you're writing the same take away zero so remaining is 450 all of it is your balance cd i'm writing bal cd just to make it shorter but please do write balance cd in exam 30th of april and on the other side of the account after the total it becomes balance bd first off me let's move to the other example or question so wyvern uh products producers limited rather hmm? and i believe it's a payables account but no matter payables receivables uh you know how to do balance cdbd you got to check uh, both sides this time both sides makes it 200 so 200 and 200 there is no balancing figure there's no balance cdbd you don't need to do any balance cdbd so there is no balance cdbd it is balanced okay the final one a larson uh it looks like it's a trade payable but none of our concern we just want to do a balance cdbd and we want to see which side is bigger clearly credit side is bigger 250 going to write the same total 250 take away 45 how much is remaining 205 that is your balance cd for last date of the month 30th of april that becomes your balance bd 205 on the other side now balance cd bd first may can be either side no problem at all if it is a debit account it should be on the debit side the bd if it is a credit account it should be on the uh, credit side that's the concept thanks for watching